three, two, one, zero. Can you hear me, Tim? Can you open your eyes? Sheriff, would you check the door and confirm that it's securely locked? Tim, the lights are going very dim. It's getting very dark in here. Wouldn't it be nice to get out of here? Out into the light? It's so dark in here. It's getting darker, Tim. The light is almost gone. You've got to get out of here, Tim. The darkness is closing in. Hurry, there's no time. The light is almost gone. Get out, now. I snap my fingers, you'll wake up. <laughs> I'm really impressed, Renee. Really impressed. You deserve the Marquis de Sade Award. Well, we know the boy's strong enough, Jake. Okay, I'll give it to you. Under certain extreme circumstances, autistics can demonstrate... <sighs> can I remind you that Houdini over here had to hypnotize him into hysterics in order to get him to do it? Boy had no motive at all to kill his parents. We found semen stains on the sheets. Oh, so what? So the wardens had an active sex life. As a matter of fact, as a matter of fact, I think that the wardens were just about to get into it when the killer showed up. Jake. I got that already. I said semen, Jake, but only semen. There was no sign of a woman, no sign of the wife in the bed at all. And we found these. I found the negatives for these in the back of a picture frame. Now, I think that's motive enough for the boy, don't you? It seems Fred Warden wasn't using his wife for recreation, he was using his son. <laughs>